Hello students, good morning to all of you. Today we are going to discuss about another important concept here, current electricity. This is the fifth part. Alright, so today concept is superconductors. This session first concept is superconductors as well as color code of resistors. Okay, superconductors. What is the meaning of superconductors? What is the meaning of superconductors? Right, it is a depends on temperature only. So generally, you know what is that resistivity is depends on temperature. Correct? Resistivity is depends on temperature. But some materials, you can remember clearly this point. What is that? Some materials, some materials, the resistivity is decreases from higher to low temperature, decrease, 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 decrease like that only at one particular temperature at certain temperature at certain temperature that resistivity suddenly is becomes zero suddenly becomes zero for example you can observe here so this is the one of your conductor one of your conductor so now this is the high temperature so resistivity also maximum now temperature is decreases 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 at over some particular temperature, what would be happen? The resistivity is becomes zero. Becomes zero. At this point, temperature is what? At this point, temperature is equal to what? Such a type of conductors are what? Such type of conductors are is equal to what? This type of phenomenon is what? Like the three questions are there. What is the first one? So temperature is equal at this point. That means temperature is becomes zero. That temperature is equal to what? Such a type of materials. Okay, conductors are what? This phenomenon is equal to what? This is the concept today. Right? So that is nothing but superconductors. Right? Okay, you can once observe here. First one is critical temperature. Critical temperature. That temperature is what? Critical temperature. Yes or no? So at particular temperature, the resistivity is becomes zero. That temperature is known as critical temperature. As well as that conductors are known as superconductors. Okay. That conductors are known as superconductors. That phenomenon is known as superconductivity. Superconductivity. Are you clear? Okay. Now we will see that. What is that critical temperature? Critical temperature is nothing but we see that for some materials below a certain temperature, the resistivity is becomes zero. Correct? We see that for some materials, not all materials, some materials, below a certain temperature, the resistivity is becomes zero. This temperature is called critical temperature. The such type of temperature is known as critical temperature. As well as the material in this state, the material in this state is called superconductors. Okay, that conductors, that conductors are known as superconductors. Superconductors mean the resistivity is becomes zero at certain temperature. Such a type of materials are known as superconductors. And the phenomenon is called superconductivity. That phenomenon is known as superconductivity. Right? That is the superconductors story. Right? Superconductors. It is a depends on so temperature only. So the temperature is known, critical temperature. That material is known as superconductor. This phenomenon is known as superconductivity. Right? As well as one more point. It was observed. It was observed for mercury in 1911. This is observed by one famous scientist. His name is, what is that? Kamerli Owens. What is that? Kamerli Owens. He Owens is observed mercury in 1911. This situation, what is that? What is that? At 4.2 Kelvin. 4.2 Kelvin. Temperature. At 
temperature is how much 4.2 kelvin in that case what would be happen the resistivity is becomes a temperature becomes a zero so the temperature is not a critical temperature so the very important point of this one what is that critical temperature of mercury critical temperature of mercury is how much 4.2 kelvin 4.2 kelvin all right the critical temperature depends on the nature of the material this point also remember what is that critical temperature depends on the nature of the material nature of the material and the resistance of hg mean mercury becomes zero at 4 kelvin generally we will give like a 4 kelvin at 4 kelvin temperature is equal to 4 kelvin the the resistivity the resistivity the resistance okay now so what is that the resistance one more point also resistance resistivity as well as resistance also resistance at 4 kelvin becomes zero resistivity general point this is the resistivity is becomes zero resistivity is becomes zero resistivity zero mean resistance also zero Correct only na? So that is a small example. So for example, the resistance of HC becomes zero at four Kelvin. This is the superconductor's diagram. Diagram is a general diagram, general metal, normal metal, normal metal. So so resistance resistivity decreases, decreases again, increases, but do not become so zero. Do not become zero. First it decreases and again increases. Like that curve will come. Are you clear? This is the story of superconductor spirit. So now next topic. Next topic is color code of resistors. Color code of resistors. Right. This one also very very important topic. This one for PU purpose, for CET purpose, need purpose. Very important question. Right. For CET purpose. So same dialogue. Now what is that? Without that question question paper we won't expect which one color code resistors that much important concept which one color code of resistors okay so generally we have seen color uh, resistors we have seen in the mechanic shop that is electrical mechanic electrical shop okay some resistors will be there in that resistors different different colors are there different different colors will be there so for example here i have one of a uh, resistor one of a resistor like that will be there so here one color here one color here one color here one color total four colors will be there these two colors can indicate significant figures these color can indicate indicate order of magnitude order of magnitude this fourth color can indicate the uh, so what is that so tolerance how much percentage will be there this is we can call it a percent uh, tolerance mean percentage how much will be there is the third color third color is so order of magnitude these two colors are significant figures significant of figures that means these colors we have to use to find the resistance of a given conductor with the help of colors, with the help of colors, we will find easily the resistance of that resistor. With the help of colors only. With the help of colors only, easily we can identify this uh, uh, resistance. This are now we have to use in the electrical appliances only. Okay, electrical appliances we have to use. Without resistor, electronic devices cannot work. Right? So, compulsory what is required? Uh, resistors are required okay the resistor value we will give you with help of color codes only as a commercially we have to use this one all right generally resistors we can classify into two groups one is wire wound resistors wire wound resistors second one is carbon resistors carbon resistors these are the carbon resistors only these are the carbon resistors. Wire wound resistors mean rheostat, all those things will come. 
okay uh, rheostat you know rheostat on the rheostat we have seen in the one wire either manganese or anything resistor is the wounded like that only okay na rheostat right that is called wire wound resistors in the commercial purpose we have to use in the electronic devices in the dvd player television t okay computers okay anywhere every electro electronic devices such type of devices we have to use this type of resistors carbon resistors that is why carbon resistors is a very very important role in electronic devices only are you clear okay so general points you can see once we have what is that colorful resistors for different electrical and electronic circuits for different electrical and electronic circuits we require resistors of different values requires different values of resistors all right next second point resistors may be divided into two groups resistors may be divided into two groups one is wire wound resistors we want to speak about that now right now main important is carbon resistors only but anyhow wire wound resistor is the first group and the second group is the carbon resistors carbon resistors okay next point in wire wound resistors of definite length which are having definite length according to value of resistance according to value of resistance is wound two fold over insulating cylinder insulating cylinder it can wound right to make it non inductive to make it non inductive yes rheostat you know is a better example that is only are you clear okay next right so for carbon resistor purpose i have given what is that so why would resistor over now carbon resistors carbon resistors ah see that to make carbon resistor carbon with a suitable binding agent is molded into cylinder okay there is a description not required but just to, you have to remember what is that so carbon material carbon resistors carbon resistors to make carbon resistor carbon carbon powder carbon powder a suitable binding agent so whatever may be so binding agent so that is a mechanical right mechanical process only yes or no so that binding that uh, uh, suitable binding agent is molded into a cylinder this is a cylinder shape only which one so our carbon resistor shape is what cylinder shape and uh, why leads are attached to the cylinder for connecting it to an electrical circuit in the middle one wire will be there so one wire will be there is a carbon resistor will be this is the resistance will be there at the same time here one coaxial wire will be there coaxial wire middle here right, coaxial wire the value of resistance is indicated by four colored this is the most important here we are having four colors some resistors are having so five like that also so but mainly we have to speak in this class okay in the pu level we will consider as the only just to four colors four colors remaining colors are also no problem but uh, so this one this one five colors is there mean this for three colors are the what is that uh, significant figures will come next uh, fourth color is so that means last color not to not in this color before that color is always we will consider as a multiplier we will consider as a multiplier last one is this is a tolerance this is the tolerance 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 before tolerance color always we want to consider as a multiplier as a multi this is the so for uh, four colors bands with marked on the cylinder this is well, this is a brief description only this is made up of carbon only inside so which, which is having one wire okay coaxial coaxial so different colors will be there mainly we are having four colors 
So this is the first color, this is the second color, this is the third color, this is the fourth color. Here first and second colors, first and second colors gives magnitude me significant figures only. We are having for example this is the black color, this is the red color, okay this is the green color, this is the tolerance. I will consider gold. Okay, I will consider gold. So now this is what I told this is the blue or black. Okay, I took blue for example. Is the blue mean blue color code is equal to how much? With the help of this this values, we will give you total this carbon resistor resistance value. Okay, here blue mean blue color. Where is the blue color? Blue color will be that this is a uh, this is a tablet I have remember. So blue color significance is equal to how much? Six. And red color, red color significance is equal to how much? Red color significance is 2. Similarly, this is I told you green. Green color significance is equal to 5. Okay. So, first and second we will consider as a significance. These two, magnitude of significance. But third one we will consider as a gives multiplier multiplier mean 10 power 1 10 power 2 10 power 3 like that multiplier only okay next fourth color fourth color gives tolerance 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 is nothing but the variation percentage around given value this is the variation how much percentage should be there how much total percentage will be there that tolerance is gives that is the tolerance okay last color is the last color we will consider as the tolerance. This tolerance we will consider two color, three colors only. Three colors. One is gold. Next one is silver. Ag. Okay. Next one is no color. There is no color. That is we can call we can consider as a no color. No color tolerance is equal to how much? So these are all values. You have to remember clearly. For that remembering purpose only, we are having this tabular column. Okay. This tabular column remembering purpose, we are having one code, color code. That's why we are calling color code. What is that color code? So very simple letter only that is. So B B Roy B B R O Y B B Roy name that is B B Roy Great Britain. Great Britain has very good wife. Right? Very good wife. Like that we are having one small code. What is that? B.B. Roy, Great Britain has very good wife. Very good wife. Okay. She is having gold, silver as well as no colors. She is having gold color bangles and silver colors. So, and no colors like that only. So, B.B. Roy, Great Britain has very good wife here b mean black this b mean brown r mean red this is the black first two color is black second color is a brown third color is red is a orange this is the yellow here g mean green g mean green five i have given five is what so green and b is the six sixth color that is the blue all right Next one, V is the seven number I have given. Seven. What is seven? Violet color. Okay, next G, good. G8 here. So, 8 is what? Gray color. So, next W, 9. So, 9 is white. Okay, with the help of the simple formula, we can identify easily that color values. Okay, here, blue, blue, green. So, just you can remember, be right. B.B. Roy, Great Britain has very good wife. B.B. Roy, Great Britain has very good wife. This word you have to remember clearly based on that problems are very easy. Alright, remember here. Black is digit is 0. Black is 0. Next, brown is 1. Significant that is. We want to multiply 0 into 1. 0 are like that only. Just a significant only. So, black means 0. Brown means 1. Red is 2, orange is 3, uh, yellow is 4, green is 5, blue is 6, violet is 7. So like that one, 0, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, up to 9. So here there is no digit. 
there is no why because gold silver no colors are so tolerant so that's why we want to give you significant digits and multiply also multiply we will give you so divide divide by 10 power minus 1 10 power minus 2 like that only right so black multiplier zero only na yeah, zero means 10 power zero is equal to one multiply purpose so how sir that is that mean so later i will give examples right okay next brown purpose so brown power multiplier is equal to 10 power 1 10 power 1 means 10 only correct similarly orange orange multiplier is equal to 10 power 3 so yellow is 10 power 4 green is 10 power 5 blue is 10 power 6 10 power 7 10 power 8 10 power 9 up to white so now silver color color in sorry multiplier is equal to 10 power minus 1 as a gold still 10 power minus 1 silver is 10 power minus 2 and no color is nothing here but tolerance tolerance is very very important here gold tolerance we will consider as a 5 percentage okay this is the exponential value only so how we know sir 5 percent 10 percent only that and all don't ask okay that is the exponential values only so gold is a 5 percent tolerance will be there silver is 10 percent and no color is 20 percent these three is we can call it a tolerance okay these are having tolerance tolerance of gold is 5 percent tolerance of silver is 10 percent tolerance of no color is 20 percent this time with help of this table column we will solve very very important problems problems are very important okay now we will solve some example problems based on this topic only right okay right so remember here the resistance finding purpose we have to use this formula very very important formula this one remember everybody what is that r is equal to a b into 10 power c plus or minus alpha percentage resistance we can measure in ohms only okay a is the first color b is the second color c is the third color and alpha is the tolerance alpha is the tolerance we can remember a is the first color b is the second color c is the third color alpha is the tolerance symbol only okay tolerance purpose we have to use alpha so percentage as usual right so how much percentage you know that one that much only so alpha percentage means five percentage are you clear okay then i have given one problem here find the resistance of carbon resistor as shown in the figure okay like the diagram will be there so first one i have given blue color second one green color i have given third one black i have given tolerance is equal to gold then find the total resistance okay so formula just now i told what is the formula so r is equal to ab into 10 power c plus r minus alpha percentage ohms correct now substitute values where a is equal to what to blue blue uh, blue value is, is, is significance is how much six blue is the six green is the where is the green five okay i have a double column here but you have to remember this one only okay bb roy bb right as well as this number and the color also remember b mean first mean black this one is the so brown blue or black and brown so where is uh, blue this is the blue blue is the six are you clear bb roy great britain has very good vibe this is the very very important formula you have to remember this one okay otherwise we can't remember these all values okay all right so next one black black is equal to zero significance all right alpha gold gold is how much for four five percent yes now substitute values only so a is equal to how much six and b is equal to five don't multiply 6 into 5 that is not like that only no don't multiply that is a significant only 6 6 a 5 5 only no need to don't multiply 6 into 5 65 that is not a into 65 into 10 power c value c value how much 0 plus or minus alpha value is how much 5 percentage into ohms okay na? so 65 into 10 power 0 mean so 1 only na? so plus or minus 5 percentage now you have to multiply 65 into 1 65 plus or minus 5 percentage ohms 
okay resistance we can we can uh, show it with the help of percentage so plus or minus compulsory no need to write so one time plus one time minus like that so plus or minus this is a formula okay so this value is how much 65 plus or minus 5 percentage ohm that much will be there okay 10 power 1 here 10 power 0 mean 1 only so some value is there but you have to put 10 power 2 mean 10 power 2 like that only you have to keep 10 power 3 mean 10 power 3 like that only you have to keep are you clear so right now second problem right this is the second problem in second model second model they given problem like that what is the resistance value they given now resistance r is equal to 36 into 10 power 3 plus or minus 10 percent ohm find the colors of carbon resistors now you have to find it uh, colors only okay now. so what is the given question here r is equal to 36 into 10 power 3 plus or minus 10 percentage ohm only Correct? So this is a compare with the A into B into 10 power C plus or minus 10. So alpha percentage. Alpha percentage. Correct? A is equal to first color. A is equal to first color. Right? A is equal to 3. 3 is equal to what is 3 color is? Orange. That is the orange. And B is equal to how much? 6. 6 is equal to what? Blue. Right? Blue. Next, C. C is equal to power only had observed. 3. 3 is what? Again, orange. Okay, no problem. So, that is orange. Next, alpha. Alpha is equal to what? 10 percent is given. 10 percent means silver. Okay, AG. Silver is AG. This is the second model. Right. Okay. Next. Right. So, next third model problem like that I have given. What is that? One carbon resistor I have given. So, this color is brown. Okay. And this color is yellow. This color is green. This color is gold. This color is gold. Then, I am asking question. Show that r is equal to 1.4 plus or minus 0.07 mega ohms okay so what is the my question so show that r is equal to 1.4 plus or minus 0.07 mega ohms that is the third model right so for such type of question purpose how can we follow same procedure only what is that so first formula what is the formula R is equal to AB into 10 power C plus R minus alpha percentage. Okay now. Therefore, this is the O. Then R is equal to here AB into 10 power C take common. Okay, this is related to only this part or not in this part. That is most important part here. So 10 power AB into 10 power C take common. So what will come here? 1 plus R minus alpha percentage. Are you clear? So, ohm as usual. So, ohm is as usual. So, AB into 10 power C into 1 plus R minus alpha power. No more, no more confusion. Sir, here we want to write it divided by like that only. So, this is tolerance is the individual. Are you clear? Right now. Right now it is the individual. So that we want to disturb this alpha percentage. Okay. Na? So, just I took this one common only. So here 1 plus R minus alpha percentage. Now instead of A, instead of B, instead of C, you can substitute values only. Correct or not? A is equal to, A is equal to what? Brown. Brown is equal to how much? 1. Next yellow is the B. Yellow color is how much? Yellow color is a 4. Next green, C. Green is equal to how much? 5. Next gold is alpha percentage. Alpha percentage is equal to 5 percentage. Alpha is equal to 5 percentage. Correct or then substitute values. A is equal to 1. B is equal to 4 into 10 power 5 into 1 plus or minus 5 percentage. I have written 5 by 100. Any objection? No. Percentage I have written 5 by 100. Correct? Then, now this is a 14 will be there. This 14 can I write 1.4 into 10 power 6. Any objection? No. No. Right. 1 plus or minus 5 by 100. Oh, so now what is the 10 power 6? Mega. 
and 10 power 6 is the mega so now 1.4 you can send inside only 1.4 into 1 so 1.4 plus r minus 1.4 into 5 14 5 is 70 right so point will be 7 by 100 now it is enter into inside previous i told this is the only this part only like that only but now so after substitution values this 1.4 you have to multiply by 1 multiply by 5 by 100 understood yeah? so 10 power 6 10 power 6 mean mega mega ohms so 1.4 plus r minus this is the 0 0.07 right mega ohms this is the resistance right are you clear all right next right next model is find the colors of carbon resistors now question is given r is equal to 1.4 plus r minus 0 0.07 mega ohms is like that is given they asking so what are the colors so color this is the one is nothing but uh, brown four is nothing but what is the yellow so 0 0.07 0 0.07 so this one uh, we want to calculate correct uh? so 0 0.07 same procedure again. What is that? So here given R is equal to 1.4. 1.4 take common. So first of all, first 1.4 plus R minus 0 0.07 into mega mean 10 power 6 ohms. So 1.4 take common. So 1.4 into 10 power 6. 1 plus R minus this is the 0 0.07 by 1.4. Okay, now I want to percentage. Percentage I want to mean I want to multiply by 100. Correct percentage percentage I want to mean I want to multiply by 100. Correct or anger? So this one, how much will come? 14 into 10 power 5 into 1 plus R minus. This is the 7 by uh, 7 by 1.4. So 14 mean here I will consider 0. 70 for, for one point will one digit will be there. Therefore, I multiply by 10 only. So oh. So 14 1 ja, 14 5 ja. Therefore, so this is the send inside again. So 14 into 10 power 5 plus R minus. So how much? 5 percentage. Finish. What is this? R. This is the look like again. A B into 10 power C plus R minus alpha percentage. Boom. Okay. A is equal to 1. What is equal to brown? And B is equal to 4. 4 is equal to a low. Correct? C is equal to how much? 5. 5 is equal to gray. Then alpha. Alpha percentage. How much? 5 is given. 5 percentage mean gold. Alpha value how much? 5 percentage. Are you clear? So, like that we have to find it. This is the fourth model. Right. This, that's it. The total four models are their problems. So based on that only questions they will ask. So one more, two more examples I will give you. Right. Right. So next problem. What is the given? Find the color code for a resistor of resistance 350 milli ohms with the tolerance is 5%. Okay. Resistance is given. What is the resistance is given? R is equal to 350 milli ohms mean 10 power minus 3 plus or minus tolerance how much 5 percentage is given so ohms correct like that is given 350 milli mean 10 power minus 3 5 percent are you clear then what happened here so 3 in 35 into 1 0 here minus 2 will come 10 power minus 2 plus or minus 5 percentage ohm 5 percentage O. Okay. Then now, so what is that here? So R is equal to this is the A and this is the B. This is the C. So this is the C. This is the alpha percentage. Okay. So A is equal to how much? 3. 3 mean 3 is equal to how much? Orange. Then B. B is equal to 5. 5 is nothing but green. Then 10 power minus 2. 10 power minus 2 mean what is that? Silver. So C. 10 power minus 2. Is equal to what is that? So silver. 
then tolerance five percent is five percent alpha percent is is given so five percent is is equal to gold so this is the one model all right so this one i will give you fifth model so fifth model all right like the problems we have to use in this manner are you clear all right ma so this is the based on resistance problems so now we will go another topic only right okay right ma next very very important question now the combination of resistors so one three mark question one five mark question will be there okay so in this questions very important for three mark or five mark cells uh, see, uh, what are the resistors in series combination and resistors are in parallel combination parallel combination is the five mark question and series combination is the three mark question three mark question okay right so combination of resistors the first question is series combination series combination very important question this one three mark question only just three marks so first point what is that consider so consider uh, two or three okay i will consider two resistors only consider two resistors two resistors r1 comma r2 can two resistor one comma r2 connected in connected in series combination series combination okay and second point here very very important in series combination in series combination current the flow of current current through circuit is same current is same but potential difference is but potential difference is different potential difference is different why is that different so that is the next i will give you all right so for example here i have two resistors so in this manner this is the first resistor and this is the second resistor okay so now this is the battery we are having like this is the resistor r1 this is the resistor r2 as a battery potential is equal to v right so now what is the potential potential is nothing but the amount of work done to bring positive charge from infinity to this like that only that means so what potential is nothing but amount of work done we want to bring positive charge from so higher potential to lower potential higher potential to lower don't say something like that sir like that only right so the current is always conventional current it can move from positive to negative so that the q charge we want to bring the charge from here to to here but here one resistor will be there here also one resistor will be there correct and here also one this is two resistors will be there so from here to to here this is a point i will consider okay so to bring charge q from here to to here some amount of work done is required that is i will consider for example w1 correct w1 right next so here also one more point will be this is the point b this is the point c point b okay point c again the charge from here to to here we want to bring there we want to bring from here to to here resistor will be there resistor is what is the nature of resistor it is the opposite the flow of charge only right flow of current only na that mean here the charge will be there the resistor will be there the current is flowing in this direction it can oppose it can oppose that mean we want to do more work only we want to do more work only right that mean at this point potential at this point potential is different Yes or no? That is why the potential is different in series combination. From here to to here, some potential. From here to here, potential. So this is the V A. This is the V B. The potential difference is how much will come? V A minus V B. Correct? You know, potential near to the this point is more. So this is the minimum only. Come back to it. You know, this under potential topic we will discuss already in the so okay, uh, electric field and charge, electric potential and the capacitance. Correct? That means near to the positive charge potential is maximum. So here potential is so V A minus V B. V A minus V B. Right here 
VB minus VC. VB minus VC. Correct only that? So that is why here potential is different in series combination. Here to here some work that is required from here to here some work that is required from here to here some work that is required. So at A at B at C the work that is different mean potential is different. Correct? That is why here this is I will consider potential between A and B is V1. So B and C potential is equal to V2. Potential is equal to V2. Therefore total potential total potential the total potential V is equal to V1 plus V2 V1 plus V2 then V is equal to what? V1 is equal to what? V2 is equal to what? in series combination correct? that is why according to Ohm's law according to Ohm's law Ohm's law you know formula what is that? V is equal to I into R V is equal to I into R only now. So that V is equal to I R. Therefore, V1 is equal to I into R1. Current is same. Same current on the flowing. Right? Uh? So the current is, there is no division. Current is divided means the current is different. But here only one circuit only now. Only one circuit. Therefore, current do not divide. So current is same. Right. Okay. Similarly, V2. V2 is equal to I into R2. This is the equation number 1. So, from 1, from 1, what is it? V is equal to V1 plus V2. So, V is equal to watch I into R is equal to, this is the I into R1. V2 is equal to I into R2. Therefore, I get cancelled. Therefore, this is, I will consider RS. RS is equal to R1 plus R2. This is the effective resistance. This is the effective resistance diagram. We can give you like that one. What is that? Effective resistance diagram in this direction. Okay. This is the R effective. This is the potential. This is the like that one. Right. RS is equal to R1 plus R2. Right. So, for I took there only two resistors only. For N resistors are there. For N resistors are connected in series combination. N resistors are there connected in series combination. Therefore, RS is equal to uh, resistors. All are having different resistance. What is that? R1, comma, R2, comma, so R3, comma, so on. Rn like that will be there. Different resistance. Okay, therefore, so R1 plus, R2 plus, so R3 plus, so on. R N that is a resistance again. So N resistors all are having different resistance. For example, all are, all are having same resistance that means equivalent resistance. Okay. Uh, for N resistors, for N resistors, all resistors, all resistors are having same resistance same resistance then R effective is equal to R effective or R series is equal to what is that R1 is equal to R R2 is equal to R R3 is equal to R plus so on R n also R how many times n times how many times n times that is why here so we can write it Rs is equal to n into R very very important formula in series combination, RS is equal to N into R for equivalent resistance. For equivalent resistance. Right. Okay. Next. Right. So, one small note you can remember here. Man. So, in this notice, I have given for I is not given in the problem. I is not given in the problem. In that case, we can't find individual potential. Correct only right? Individual point V1 is equal to how much? V2 is equal to how much? If they given I mean easily we can find it. Individual potential. But here I is not given in that case. They are asking individual potential as well as I. Okay. In that case how can we find? How can we find? Alright. So direct class you can use for problem no problem. So if they ask I we will use I is equal to V by R1 plus R2 formula. We are cutting worms. I is equal to V by R1. The total resistance is equal to how much? R1 plus R2. 
right now i we got therefore v1 is equal to i into r1 so v2 is equal to i into r2 so like that we can find it easily but so without i also we can find we can easily calculate potential potential of v1 potential of v2 how sir so simple formula what is that so uh, when two resistors are on order connect a series combination v1 is equal to v2 is equal to i is equal to what all questions they are asking so now this is a diagram so according to voltage divider we can call it that is voltage division voltage is division right here this is a v1 this is the v2 therefore according to that formula we are having that formula what is that v1 is equal to v total into r1 by r1 plus r2 r1 plus r2 v1 is equal to v total into r1 by r1 plus r2 so this is the v1 formula Similarly, V2. V2 is equal to V total into R2 by R1 plus R2. This is the V2 value. So, V2 formula purpose, we can use this one. And V2 purpose, we can use this one. V1 and V2 purpose. And I purpose, that I from I is equal to V by R1 plus R2. Finish. So, this is a one small application. Right, next one. So, second one is the parallel combination. Parallel combination, same as usual. What is that? So, consider two resistors R1, R2. We should connect in parallel combination. In parallel combination, the potential difference is the same. The, the uh, same potential difference will be there. Why is there same potential difference? Why? Because so the voltage from here to, to here only, right? Correct. So, that means from here to, to here only, same point only. That's what here, voltage is the same only. What that is same here this point as well as this point here to here work done and as well as here to here same work done only correct therefore potential is the same but current is different current is at the junction a so current is divided into this part and this part current is divided right that's what here current is not the same only potential is the same the potential difference is the same in the series in the parallel combination but the current is different so now circuit diagram you can observe here. So this is the R1, this is the R2. So I is the main current. I is divided two parts. I1 and I2 at the junction. Remember, the junction current is divided. The current can divide means that is a parallel. Current do not divide means that is a series. It is a series. Okay. So now current is divided here. This is the I1, this is the I2, R1, R, I2, R2. I1 can passing through R1, I2 can passing through R2. Again, junction here again are combined here. So again, same current is flowing through circuit. So effective circuit, we can write it like that one. We can draw like that itself. Alright, okay. The main current is divided into two parts. That is the I is equal to I1 plus I2. Then I is one is equal to how much? I2 is equal to what? This is the equation number one. So now according to Ohm's law. According to Ohm's law, we know already I is equal to V by R. Correct? I is equal to V by R. Similarly, I1 is equal to V by R1. I2 is equal to V by R2. Therefore, now these values can suffer in the equation number 1. So, from 1, what is that I? I is equal to I1 plus I2. I1 is equal to what? V by R v by r1 v by r2 so we, we get cancelled therefore what will come here 1 by r mean we can consider as a parallel combination 1 by rp is equal to 1 by r1 plus 1 by r2 this is the parallel combination formula 1 by rp is equal to 1 by r1 plus 1 by r2 so or else so 1 by rp is equal to lc means what is that r1 r2 so r2 plus r1 then rp is equal to r1 r2 divided by r1 plus r2 very very important formulas this and all you have to remember clearly rp is equal to r1 r2 divided by r1 plus r2 right this is a five mark question simple question all right okay next still continuous right continue so what is that rp is equal to rp is equal to r1 r2 divided by r1 plus r2 so what is this this is r effective for two resistors if i have n resistors for n resistors 
connected in parallel combination all are having different resistance all are having different resistance then 1 by rp is equal to 1 by r1 plus 1 by r2 plus so on 1 by rn all right similarly for n identical resistors connected in parallel combination connected in parallel combination then what is the effective resistance so 1 by rp is equal to 1 by r plus 1 by r plus 1 by r plus so on how many times n times okay n resistors are there n resistors so that 1 by rp is equal to 1 by r plus 1 by r plus 1 by r plus so much n times so n by r therefore r is equal to rp is equal to r by n it's a very important question all right very important question for identical cells for identical for identical cells sorry resistors first to connect in series combination again parallel combination then what is the relation between what is the relation between rs and rp rs and rp correct so you know rs formula what is rs formula n into r what is rp this one only na? so 1 by rp is equal to r by n so now i will do rp by rn rp by rn what is rp so i will do rs by rn better okay na? rs by rn rs by rn is equal to rs is equal to n into r divided by so r by n goes to numerator that is n into n n square therefore rs is equal to n square times of rp very important relation by this one rs is equal to what is rs rs is equal to rs is equal to n square into rp so in series combination the resistance is maximum why is it maximum so the length should be increases series combination mean the length of conductor is increases right the length can increase mean the resistance should be increases in parallel combination the resistance value should be decreases why sir decreases mean the area of cross section is increases that is why if you want more resistance you should connect in series combination if you want less less resistance but you can connect in parallel combination in the parallel combination current is more will come in series combination current is less will come okay in series combination so the bulbs are connected in series combination so one bulb is spoiled the remaining bulbs cannot glow cannot glow why because series combination one wire is blast mean so remaining circuit is closed circuit is open when the circuit is open remaining bulbs cannot glow but parallel combination, parallel combination, so uh, 10 bulbs are kind of series uh, parallel combination. So one bulb is one bulb is blast or uh, failed. Okay. In that case, what remaining nine bulbs can glow? Why? Because the circuit is the individual. The circuit is the individual like that only. Here bulb is this one spoiled me. So remaining bulb can glow. Correct only now? So that is why in series combination, one bulb can glow, it can spoil me, remaining bulbs cannot glow. In the parallel combination, not like that. Why? Because uh, circuit is not a open. So circuit is a closed. But series combination circuit is open will come. Right. Okay. This is series combination as well as parallel, com parallel combination. Next. Right. So small application this one. So previous in series combination I have given. So individual potential difference is equal to how much? V1 is equal to how much? V2 is equal to how much? Like that I ask you a question, right? Here also, current is division, right? That means I1 is equal to how much? I2 is equal to how much? I3 is so on. Correct? Like that we want to calculate. We want to find it I1 value, I2 value, I3. Like that only. Alright? So how can we find? So here we, we want to follow current division rule. What is that? 
correct division rule right so now you can observe there so division of current in resistors division of current in resistors connected in spiral combination this is current division only so now this is the battery two resistors i took there so there i this is the i now junction so through this direction i1 current through the direction i2 current i2 current so this is the r1 this is the r2 again junction here again come back there all right so now find it i1 value as well as i2 value find it i1 value and i2 value right so now solution part you can see so we know that in series co parallel combination i is equal to i1 plus i2 now so equation number one and also in parallel combination v is same v is the same in the two uh, uh, what is that circuits here that means he this uh, junction and the uh, sorry this and here kind of this way and this way so potential is equal to same that means if i take this potential in this direction potential is v1 in this direction potential is equal to v2 v1 v2 both are same correct or not that is why here so v1 is equal to v1 is the potential through r1 so v2 is the potential r to r2 v1 is the potential r to r1 so v2 is the potential r to r2 potential difference Right, that's why your potential difference is equal to same. V1 is equal to V2. So V formula, you know what is that? I into R only na? V1 is equal to I1 R1 is equal to V2 mean I2 into R2. If I want I2, if I want I1 mean I2 value, you can substitute the given equation. That is why I want first I2. I2 is equal to I1 R1 by R2. I1 R1 by R2. Equation number two. Okay. So now this is the equation number three, right? If I want I one value, so I two R two by R one divided by I one. So now first target is I one to I one, I one to I one. Therefore, from one and two, from one and two equations, what is the one? I is equal to I one plus I two value how much? I one R one divided by R two with the help of this one. All right. So now uh, you can do calculation here. What is that? So how much will come? So do cross modification. So I one R two plus I one R one divided by R two is equal to I. So now I want to I one. I one take common, therefore I one I two common, therefore uh, R one plus R two is equal to I into R two. Correct? Then I one is equal to I one is equal to R one plus R two divided by uh, sorry. So what is that? I divided by R one. R S here we consider R two, R two is equal R two divided by R one plus R two into I one. Sorry, I only. That is the formula. Alright. Similarly, suggest the reverse only will come here. R R one will come. Alright. So now I one to I two. So from one and uh, three equation, one and three. What is the first equation? I is equal to I one plus I two. Instead of I one, you can put this one only. What is that? I two R two plus do cross multiplication. I two R one divided by R one directly. I have given directly. Okay. Then what is the common? I two R one plus R two divided by R one. So now I want to. I two is equal to R one by R one plus R two into I. So this is the individual values finding purpose formula. Okay, I one is equal to I two is equal to. All right. So like that we have to calculate these values. Right, ma. So this is the combination of resistors, resistance, all those things finished. But problems are there. But problem solving purpose we are having some methods. Okay, so symmetry methods, yes or no? Potential method. This and all will be there. That means complicated circuit purpose. Complicated circuit. This is the general. 
These are general points only. So general process only. But a complicated circuit purpose, we want to follow some methods. Okay. Next session, I will give you that, uh, that methods as well as some problems I will give you. Right. So in that, so resistance fit should be finished. Are you clear? Okay. So thank you to one and all. Thank you.